Hello, and welcome to the Electra training video series. This video will cover an overview of the new EMC software from Ronan Schwartz called Electra. This software is used to perform both EMC emissions and susceptibility measurements. This includes radiated and conducted tests in both the EMI and EMS application spaces. The entire line of EMI test receivers from Roden Schwartz is supported by Electra, as well as a small subset of Roden Schwartz spectrum analyzers. As you will see later on during this video series, Electra can also control other EMC accessories, including LISNs, GTEMs, and more, and we continue to add to our supported devices list. Electra is designed to maximize efficiency in the lab with a state of the art user interface. From installing the software to setting up a measurement and creating a report with your own company's logo, Electra is straightforward and easy to use. Users can take full advantage of flexible dashboards as well as interactive measurement displays. Electra also comes loaded with pre configured measurement settings for relevant EMC standards in addition to a library full of limit lines and transducer factors to assist the occasional user. Last but not least, Electra's software structure is built off of a database as opposed to EMC32 where a folder structure was used. This enables users to create and search for test templates, results, and more very quickly and efficiently. As you will learn later, there are other useful tips and tricks that users can take advantage of to make Electra truly their own. For EMC engineers who are dissatisfied with antiquated user interfaces and need to perform both emissions and susceptibility tests, Electra is a new EMC software from Ron Schwartz, which provides a superior user experience and control for all necessary EMC equipment. We invite you to check out the rest of the Electra video series to learn more about this innovative new product. For more information and to download product literature such as the product brochure and datasheet, please visit the link shown at the end of this video. And thank you for watching.